Hello students. So in this video we are going to do one practical geometry construct a triangle PQR. So this is construction of triangle especially in 10th standard construction in construction of triangle there are three types using the median we can construct the triangle and using the altitude then using the angle bisector. So these are the three different uh, types of uh, questions which are given in your textbook. So this question is based on construct a triangle using the median. So the median the length of the median is given. So see first in the practical geometry first we have to draw a triangle. So because construct a triangle. So let us draw the rough diagram in the right corner of your uh, CW node you can you can in your node you can draw the rough diagram. So for rough diagram you no need to take any measurement just draw a simple uh, rough diagram. So this is the um, this is the median because it is joining a vertex and midpoint. See here the name of the triangle is PQR PQ 8 centimeter angle R this angle is 60 degree then and the median R to G median RG from R to PQ. So median RG is uh, how many centimeter? 5.8 centimeter. These are the uh, given question. So according to that we have drawn a rough diagram. So uh, listen step by step very carefully very simple easy to understand. So if you understand the first method using the median. so you can do it easily altitude and the angle bisector method both the method are similar way we will do we will do small alteration from this uh, method first using your scale draw a line segment pq of 8 cm okay so first you have to draw the, the base of the triangle in all the diagram. First we have to draw this line PQ is 8 cm. So any one of the sides of a triangle they will give in the given data. So you have to draw that side in the uh, uh, bottom of the triangle as a base of a triangle. So you can RQ will be the base of the triangle. Yeah. Okay, first we have draw this triangle. Then what are the next data? Angle R is 60. Angle R is 60. See here, this is P, this is Q, R will be here. So we don't know where R it where it is. So for that, what we are going to do? Keep the protector and draw that 60 degree under the line segment PQ. So, 0. So, we have to start look at from 0, 0, 10, 20, 30, 40, 50 and 60. This is 60. So, this is 60 degree. You can write it as x. Draw PQS uh, QPX 60 degree. Then place the protector on the ray PQ at P. Then mark the point exactly 90 degree. Okay. Exactly at 90 degree. 
this is y see this will be exactly 90 exactly this is an right angle this is a right angle exactly 90 but it must be six, uh, 60 so this will be 30 okay clear okay first we have drawn a line pq 8 centimeter then angle r is 60 because of that 60 or angle put on the angle so that 60 we have drawn under uh, below pq uh, pq q p or x is equal to 60 then we have drawn p y perpendicular to p x p y perpendicular to p x okay then what we are going to do we are going to uh, draw the perpendicular bisector of the line pq so perpendicular you know how to draw the perpendicular bisector take half more than the line segment and draw the draw the arcs above and below the line pq then from q just we have drawn this line then draw a smooth straight line so this is the midpoint of the line pq so midpoint of the line pq is g so this point is g okay now where the perpendicular bisector and the ray pq are intersecting here this is the intersect intersecting point of the ray pq and the perpendicular bisector so place the needle of the compass in that intersecting point then now we are going to draw a circle This circle will exactly passing through the point P and Q. Correct on the point only above. This circle will passing through the exactly passing through the points P and Q. So now we got a, cir a circle. So then from G to R, G to R is the median. So R is the, the top vertices of a triangle. So G to R 5. Point 8 centimeter so what you have to do you can take 5.8 centimeter in your compass take your compass and take 5.8 centimeter in your compass then from G to from place the needle of the compass at G this is the point of intersecting this is called R. So R in the bottom of the now similar in the you will get R. This is also both the triangles will be the similar triangle. So but, but not necessary to draw in both places. It is not compulsory. So this is also R. This is also R. So you can take any one of the point. So then join PR and this is the required triangle PQR and this is the median rg rg 5.8 centimeter see and this 
G is the midpoint of the triangle, midpoint of the side PQ. So, this is PQ, this is RG median, this is midpoint line intersect. So, R is the top vertices. That's all. Construction of triangle is over. But in this question, additionally, they have asked find the length of the altitude from R to PQ. So, what we have to do just little bit extend this line and what we are going to do from R we have to draw a perpendicular line to the base PQ to find the altitude. So using the set square in your set square uh, there will be 90 degree uh, so three types of uh, two types of set squares will be there in your uh, in your geometry box uh, this is this set square is um, 90 45 45 so one more set square will be there that is 90 60 30 so you can use any one of the set square and you can draw a perpendicular line so see this is 90 so this 90 should be here so this base should be aligned with this uh, bottom line and so this is the perpendicular line this is the altitude it is close to the side p r so it is close to the side p r so this is the altitude altitude can be we can give for this point we can give r uh, p q r this for this we can give name s yes. so r s so using the scale you measure the length of the altitude altitude the length of the altitude will be uh, 3.5 centimeter so length of the altitude r s is equal to 3.5 centimeter so in some of the uh, questions they may not ask this length of this altitude just they will ask us to construct the triangle so in such a question just we have to draw the uh, triangle so i will explain so when you are writing the step you can write not necessary to copy the textbook uh, you can write the steps by your own first a uh, dryer of diagram with given uh, given measurements then draw a line segment pq 8 cm then construct angle qpx equal to 60 then draw py perpendicular to px then construct a perpendicular bisector of the per perpendicular bisector of the line segment pq so the midpoint is g then the intersecting point of the perpendicular bisector and py is named as o so any name we can take so here i have taken o so o as a center draw a circle of radius os op or oq both the length of op and oq are same so then we have to draw the circle after that we take 5.8 centimeter and draw uh, an arc from G to intersect the circle. G is the circle intersect and arc at pandra. That is the same thing. So, very simple. Then just draw, join uh, the PQ as a 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 PQ the additional question they have asked to find the length of the altitudes from R to PQ. So just we are using the 
set square here we have drawn a perpendicular line to pq the length of the perpendicular line that is altitude the length of the altitude is 3.5 centimeter very simple question so i hope that you all understood so do step by step then you definitely you can understand easily thank you